everybody welcome back to my channel in today's video I'm making four super easy fun appetizer recipes so I hope you enjoy come along with me our first appetizer are pickle roll-ups so you're just gonna start with some softened cream cheese and add some of this dry ranch powder mix that all together really well then you're gonna take your ham and just lay that out on the cutting board about four pieces right on top of each other Spread the cream cheese over all four pieces of ham. Once you've done that, you're ready to grab your pickle spear and roll these up. You will want to try to roll these as tight as you possibly can and just make sure that everything is sticking together. Do the same thing with as many pickles as you will need for your event. And then once you're done, you're ready to cut these. Cut those into bite-sized pieces, put those on your serving tray and serve those with a toothpick in each one. And these are gonna be a huge hit. These are one of my favorite appetizers slash snacks of all time. The second appetizer is an easy cucumber bite. So I went ahead and just peeled a cucumber. Obviously use as many cucumbers as you need based on the amount of people. We just did one since there was only two of us eating these this day. After that, you're gonna take your cherry tomatoes and cut each of them in half. You want as many halves of cherry tomatoes as you have bites. I also chopped up some fresh dill this really really brings out the flavor if you have fresh dill rather than dry dill now we will start with the cream cheese mixture i just have some softened cream cheese i will go ahead and add the dill into that along with a few teaspoons of powdered ranch dressing and then a tablespoon and a half to two tablespoons of mayonnaise and mix that all up along with some garlic powder some italian seasoning and pepper to taste Mix that really well and make sure you're tasting it so you know if you need to add anything extra. Then once that's all combined, you're gonna go ahead and add that into your piping bag. I'm just gonna use a plastic baggie and cut off the corner, but you could definitely use an actual piping bag with a piping tip to make this a lot fancier. Now add just a little bit of the mixture to the top of each of your cucumbers. Once you've done that, you're gonna take a piece of your cherry tomato and just put that on top, and these are gonna be ready to serve. If you have guests that love cucumber and tomato, they are gonna love these. They are absolutely delicious. Our third appetizer is a super simple chili cheese dip. You're going to start by adding a block of cream cheese to your pan and warming that up, and then adding a can of no bean chili. Mix these all together until they're nicely combined and warmed through. You do wanna go ahead and add some sharp cheddar cheese to this as well. Unfortunately, I was just out of it that day, but that does really help with the taste. Also, you're really going to want to use a brand name chili when you make this. The generic was okay. Uh, we just didn't have any brand name chili in our store. Um, but if you can find a brand name like a Hormel, it really does make this dip taste a lot better. So once that is all warmed through and you have melted your cheese, this is ready to serve. Mm -hmm. 
And I just served that alongside some Tostito scoops. This is one of my all time favorite dips that I have been eating for years and years. And finally, we're gonna be making some taco tortilla roll-ups. So once again, I just have some softened cream cheese and I'm going to add in some rotisserie chicken that I shredded. You could use any chicken that you want. Um, I just happen to have a rotisserie chicken at home that I needed to use up. Go ahead and add those all together. Then you're gonna add in some sour cream, then some sharp cheddar cheese, some taco seasoning, and some taco sauce. Mix it all together and you are ready to start building your tortillas. You can definitely use larger tortilla shells. We're just using the taco size here since there were only a few of us eating this. So go ahead and spread the mixture all over the tortilla shell and then roll it up. Once you've rolled up all of your taco shells, then we're going to take some saran wrap and roll those up very tightly. Put those in the fridge for about an hour until they harden a little bit and then those will be ready to slice. And now we're gonna slice these just like we did with the pickle rolls. I do take the ends off since there's not as much filling in those. Go ahead, slice these into bite-sized pieces. Put those on your serving tray. And once again, you can use toothpicks with each of these to serve to your guests. the video and you got some great ideas for some appetizers for your next party or you know like we do sometimes we just eat the appetizers for dinner i am at almost 350 subscribers everybody 500 we're doing that giveaway don't forget so if you like the video hit the like button make sure you subscribe i can't wait to see you guys in the next video bye everybody